a shame for you, the people of South Africa, not to vote for somebody upon African is like Julius Malema, and instead went ahead and voted for Amzungu. Americans told you are you are your land. They raped your women. They killed your kings. Then what a shame that you people of South Africans should be recolonized yet again. You should be recognized, recolonized yet again, South Africans. Professor A.W.O. Ukipenda Awo. I want to apologize to Honorable Malema. Why? On behalf of the people of South Africa. And on the same note, allow me to condemn all the South Africans. It's a shame for you, the people of South Africa, not to vote for somebody upon African is like Julius Malema. And instead went ahead and voted for Amzungu. For a white man. It's a white man who has taken position too. And Malema pulling the tail. At number four, it's a shame that the people of South Africa can vote for a white man in South Africa. Is remember, there's nowhere else in this Africa that black people, black people suffered as much as the people of South Africa during the apartheid time in South Africa. Americans told you are your, your land, they raped your women, they killed your kings. Then what a shame to the people of Africa, for South Africans to go ahead and vote for a white man in place of such a strong black young African leader like Julius Malema. You should be condemned, the people of South Africa. You are taking us back. You are taking us back, and I can clearly, let me say, let me put it this way, that I opine that you people of South Africans should be recolonized yet again. You should be recognized, recolonized yet again, South Africans, because you are shameful, you cannot be helped. Just the other day you were on, on the street killing your fellow Africans, killing Nigerians in South Africa. Killing Kenyans, targeting Ghanaians, accusing them of taking your jobs. But how much have the white men taken away from you, you South Africans? They have taken your land, you own nothing. They own 90% of your land. You only own 10% of South African land. So you can easily kill your African brothers accusing them of taking your jobs but you are going ahead to vote for a white man to take after after Ramaphosa so suppose something happens god forbid to Ramaphosa suppose something happens to Ramaphosa and another election is called in South Africa who will be the president who is more likely to take that seat, if not that white man of the Democratic Alliance? It's a shame. It's a big insult to us Africans. We are heading towards the direction of one Africa. But South Africans are taking us back. I condemn you, South Africans. I condemn you. It's about time you, South Africans, teach your children. Because it's very clear that your forefathers never taught you. That's why you are voting in a white man. Yeah, bringing a white man at position two is close to voting in 